Well, we got a new AI model called a DIT360. So essentially, you can generate a high quality panoramic or 360 degree view of any landscape using a text description with this AI image model. Now, you might be thinking that, well, you can create pictures that look like this, maybe using Gemini's Nano Banana or ChatGPT. Well, no, that's actually uh, very specific. You cannot use Gemini or ChatGPT to generate that picture. These are some examples that I created using uh, Gemini and ChatGPT. And as you can see, they're not even close to the examples that were provided by the team behind the IT360. And speaking about the team, this model was actually created in collaboration with Insta360. Now, in case you didn't know, this is actually a very popular company when it comes to creating high quality cameras. So they made great cameras and one of them is of course the 360 degree view camera i think that's kind of fitting they are uh, contributing to this research and also i noticed that uh we got something great from this place finally now anyway uh, later i'm going to show you how you can actually use this model online for free to generate high quality pictures that look like these ones and uh, some of you might be quite familiar with other models like Fun Fusion, SMGD, Hunyuan World, and uh, of course, now we have the IT360. And a few things that are great about this model is one, it is faster, and secondly, it seems to be more accurate, so the stitches are not as visible. Basically, it's going to be more seamless compared to other models. And of course, it's always great that we have better models. Now, uh, if you navigate to this research page, they actually have some examples and you can actually download some of them. For example, I'm going to download perhaps, let me check some pictures that look very interesting. Okay. Okay, let's, let's try this one. I'm going to save it to my computer and you can use free online tools that are able to open or view a 360 degree image. And actually, there are plenty of websites that can do that. So this is one example. I'm going to just drag and drop the picture right here. And the image is now visible. I can interact with the page. This is quite a similar experience to the virtual reality platform. And also when you're watching uh, videos, some VR, I forgot the name of that. I think it was 360 degree view video on YouTube. And also there are uh, some content online that might be presented this way so this picture was generated by i i think i don't see any uh, any, any stitch at all i think it's quite seamless maybe the picture is not quite sharp but perhaps if, if they can pair this technology with a bigger AI model i think the picture quality is going to be improved so uh, if you are interested to use this AI model to generate uh, pictures maybe some uh, room interior or some uh, landscape or perhaps anything that may be useful in your project then you can navigate to uh, this page they actually have a free demo on hugging face just navigate to this link don't worry all the links will be available in the description down below and here the way to use it is quite simple you can just describe what is the scene that you want to create now i'll try to use the same prompt as the one that i used on gemini and ChatGPT, which is generating the 360 degree view of Lamborghini. So Gemini is not able to do that. ChatGPT is the same. And let's see if this tool is actually telling the truth. Now I'm going to click generate and just wait for a few seconds up to a minute. All right, so we got a proper panoramic feature finally. Now I'm going to save it to my computer. And I'm going to use the same tool again to actually open or view the picture. So let me just drag and drop. And there you go. As you can see, this is definitely a proper panoramic view. And that's something that you can get using the DIT360 AI model. So again, just navigate to this URL. And if you want to see some examples or you want to see the research paper, then you can navigate to this page as well. And I'll just leave all the links in the description down below. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you on my next video. Have a great day.